Hey guys, Zent up here. Today we're going to be checking out this weatherproof LED solar powered wall light with motion sensor that 1x1 one one sent me. I've been eagerly waiting to have this so we can put it on the outside of the house where we have a spot where there's a little bit of light, but then I lost it for a couple weeks. But I did find it today and we are going to open up this box and see what we get. So here we have the light, some screws, and the instructions. We already know what we're gonna do with those. So, let's play with the light. Uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight LED lights here. That looks like it's the motion sensor, probably night um, sensor thing. Up here we have the solar panel. And uh, back here we have off, one, two, and three. I guess there's uh, three different powers of light for this. So let's see here. Oh, and it probably takes some batteries. Let's open. We got the back off, and back here we have a 1500 milliamp hour, 3.7 volt lithium ion battery. Um, it's not a. It's a lot bigger than a double A AA or triple A, so I don't think I'll be able to replace that battery when it gets uh, old or something unless um, I can order one from the factory so we're gonna put this back together again put the screws back in and go mount it outside so I was playing with this thing to see what the different lights were and here's one kind of a dim light here's two a brighter light and then three and two seem to be the exact same brightness so um, yeah let's look at the instructions here so what we have is a uh, let's talk about the solar panel itself is 5.5 volts which comes out to 1.6 watts the power rating for the LED lights is 1.6 watts so it looks like this will charge or for as long as this is charging is as long as it'll stay lit. Um, the thing here on the box, which is the question I had, was talking about the light modes. And there's a high light mode, a dim light mode, and a sensor mode. Um, I think those are kind of out of order because I think it goes dim first. So there's dim on one. There's high on two, so that's kind of backwards there. And then the sensor mode is three. And what the sensor mode does is if it sees somebody or senses somebody moving nearby, it will automatically uh, turn on. And then after 15 seconds of nobody being in range, it will turn off. And that's exactly what we wanted. We wanted to be able to uh, have it shine when we walk out there and then have it turn off and charge up the rest of the time. So, that is the mode we're going to keep it on as number three. See, just turned off. Motion again. Turns back on. So, we're going to keep it on that one. And then we are going to take this thing outside, screw it into these little holes right here, into the roof line somewhere. Out here by the cars is a spot that we want to shine that light onto. Because the light from the porch and the light from the side of the house doesn't reach here. Right about here somewhere, up as high as I can get it, I think is where we're gonna put it because the sun comes from over there, where it is now, comes straight over the house and goes down that way. So it should give us enough daylight to charge this thing back up for as little as we're gonna use it. So we're probably gonna put it maybe right up there in that corner. I ended up putting it in the front corner just because, well, I couldn't reach the back corner with this little step ladder here that I have. So we will wait until it gets darker out tonight and we will come out and try this. Okay, we turned off the side porch light so it is nice and dark out here and Baby Girl wanted to go run into the motion sensor so we're going to have her do that now. And you see that lights it up pretty well. It'll stay on for about 15 seconds with no motion and then it'll turn itself off. Charge all day by the sun, motion sets it off at night, and you always have light where you need it. Now the manufacturer of this product told me 
that they will give a discount to my subscribers so check in the link below in the description for that discount code well that's all i have for this video as always don't forget to comment rate subscribe check us out on the website and we'll see you guys on the next one